And here we are at the Monastic Gym. There's the ball guy. But he ain't gonna give me anything new, so let's head on in. And we'll show you what a real champion time is. Ah, Babu. Oh, Kabu. Champion Bill and... wait. Champion Bill and Pierce and Hop 2. Hop 2. I forget what I did for his voice. Mr. Kabu, I'm glad you remember me. Of course I do. You two were red hot after all. I'd never forget seeing you off after you completed your first leg of the gym challenge. Don't think we really got the time for our friendly chinwag. Right. Actually, the situation is getting pretty grim and bad over at the stadium. Yeah, that'd be why we're here. Ah, uh, brilliant. The opponent's a bit much to take on single-handedly, so I was wondering what to do. But with you all by my side, my confidence in this battle is burning brighter by the minute. Let's begin. With his little hop running. Ooh. Okay. No solar beam from this torquil, I hope. Hmm. Fight. The power of that is going to be repeat. Okay. Here we go. Very good. Should get rid of ah. now my special defense is increased. Very good. Hmm. Slam. Oh, real boom. Well, obstacle took that pretty well. Uh oh. Hmm. Let's see, which one's stronger? Even if it's reduced by the sunlight, maybe it'll hit harder. No, I should have used the uh, rock move. Ah, but now we'll reduce his fire attacks. Okay. Slam. And chomp. There we go. There goes the twerk. Well done. Looks like we were able to extinguish things this time. I'll, I'll let this Pokemon rest here at Motostook Stadium until it gets its energy back. And Bill, should you have need of my help, please do not hesitate to ask. I still think Rachel Ghoul's voice from the original Batman, from the 90s Batman cartoon, would be perfect for him. Don't worry, I know, you all have more work that needs to be done, yes. Go forward, youths, I wish you well. Beep, 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 beep. Hey, Bill, that your return phone ringing? <laughs> when, when can we get that cell phone? Okay. And is there a way I can change the case's cover? Okay. Focus. Bill, we got trouble. Those two weirdos have showed up at the Pokemon lab. What? Sonya, you alright? They keep rudely demanding I hand over wishing stars. I'm alright for now, but get over here quick, okay? These guys are right creepy. What are those two doing going after wishing stars? 
We've got to help Sonya get back the rusted shield. Let's hurry to the Pokemon lab. He really doesn't think about anything, though. True. Sure does make him seem like a proper fool. Nah, guess the word would be reckless. We're headed to the Pokemon lab next, right? Guess I'll stick by you till we see this through. And away we go. Since I don't know what to expect... Hmm... Yeah, swap. Back down to Wedgehurst. This is pretty fun, I, I'd say. It's very involved. Alright, let's go down to the Pokemon Lab. Because I know where it is this time. I haven't forgotten. Alright. Save. Let's see what these nincompoops are up to. We know all the wishing stars that Chairman Rose had gathered are here. We celebrities have enhanced level of insight into such things. You non-celebrities are not suited to having such valuable things. Hand them over to us. Wishing stars and being a celebrity have nothing to do with each other. I don't know how you even knew about this, but there's no way we're giving them to you. That's right. You can never understand how important these wishing stars are. You have no need for them. Goodness. Whatever should we do, younger brother? It would certainly seem we have been inconvenienced, older brother. Wahahaha! <sighs> Here we go. Here we go. Are those herbs growing up? So okay. Sonya and the professor are the ones who have been inconvenienced here. Hop! For some Pokemon and Dynamax against their will, you've gone out of their out of bounds here. And I haven't forgot about getting back the rusted shield either. Well, well, well. I certainly thought the champion would come, but I didn't think a loser would follow. Must I have you once again taste the flavor of a humiliating defeat? Uh, don't let those goons put you down. That's right. You lost a battle, but don't lose the rock and spirit. R right. Steady on. Bill, thanks, mate. First things first, let's get these weirdos out of here. Weirdos? Oh, how they wound me, older brother, to be called such terrible things as weirdos by these ruffians. Indeed, to address royals such as ourselves in such a manner cannot will not be forgiven. This time we brought a much stronger Pokemon to thoroughly trounce you in. Double battle. Ugh. Okay. Hmm. Here we go. Fight. And then Pyro Ball on Bronzong. Uh oh. Why? Uh oh. Ooh. Yes. Oh. Clearly, I was the threat to this team, but, but, fear not. And since it already took some damage, what levels are their Pokemon at, by the way? Oh, they're in their 60s. Okay, let's get rid of that Colossal Pod. You're just trying to make your double paint. And away it goes. Two blade. Hmm. Wait. I'm 
bronze arm. You're doing more damage to yourself than you are to the Pokemon. Let's see, I got Okay, let's see. Yes. Ooh, maybe... Okay, swap. Hmm. Let's get rid of the bronze on. My double was so much better. Is so much better. There we go. Very good. Poor Cinderace. Ooh. Let's outspeed and get rid of this. Oh, come on. What? Hmm. Good for Rillaboom. Uh oh. Let's just get rid of Dewblade. Very good. Hopefully Grim Snarl will survive. Okay. All right. Let's see if our Grim Snarl can get rid of Fish Sharp. Yes. While the Phalanx stays there. Still bitter about that thing getting away from me. And there I go. I wonder if in Shield, if Shield Burt is the older brother instead of the younger. Uh oh. Hmm. And there it goes. No way to retreat now. Right. Get rid of the Glossal Puck first. Aha! Very good. Uh-oh, but it'll take great coil damage. Good, good, good. Now, let's see. Swap. Aha.
speed increased. But no matter. Now let's just take it out in one sweep. Uh oh. And there goes Corviknight. It's not my Corviknight. Or I like my Corviknight. And a simple Brick Break finishes the day. Vexing predicament indeed, older brother. Surely this must be some kind of mistake, wouldn't you say, younger brother? Now that was some that was some celebrity catch. I did it! We won! We really won! The whites of their eyes only showing is kinda creepy. The exquisite Pokemon we trained actually lost. Hmm. <laughs> You only won because you two teamed up. Still, we offer you Ruffians our praise. Oi, the two of you teamed up too. Get back the rest of shield and stop forcing Pokemon to go all crazy. Uh, sorry, is this a bad time? My apologies for the intrusion. Those men are dangerous. Be careful. Well done. Your infiltration mission was a resounding success, it seems. Have you gathered the wishing stars? Yes, thanks to Master Sword, Sword Word and Shilbert buying me so much time. Really? What? Stop! Get back those wishing stars! Oh dear, it would seem we've been completely had. <laughs> Why, this moment is so sweet. I don't think I need any sugar in my tea later. Our battle with you was a little trick. We'd won before you grabbed a single Pokeball. And with that, fare thee well. Stop! Why? Professor Sonia, I'm sorry. Was everything... Was it all a lie right from the start? There was no helping it. It was necessary for the plan. Our plan to put Galar under control of royal lineage once again. Ooh, now this seems a little more interesting. All right, so here we go. Seems that a lot did. Ha seems that a lot did have something to back up all their big talk. So those two weren't working alone? One of their followers even betrayed Sonya. That's real rough. Okay. Wait, don't just leave without saying anything. I tried to. But you were upset. We didn't want to say anything to make it worse. Oh, I didn't do the voice. Oh, well. We were trying to be considerate, but... Of course I'd be down on myself. It was my fault I got tricked. By a naked and will lose clothing. Nice. But that's it. No more feeling sorry for myself. That lot made off like bandits with the wishing stars. It'd be awful if they were used for some evil purpose, so there's no time for feeling down. Ow! <laughs> you got some guts. You've certainly grown strong in the face of adversity, dearie. Gran! Don and Maxim draws out the true strength and the trust between the Pokemon and their trainer. But that group is likely pouring the Galar particles emitted by the Wishing Stars into Pokemon, forcing them to Dynamax. Yeah. The theft of the Wishing Stars was just the start. Things get a lot worse from here on. But why? What reason could they have for forcing Pokemon to Dynamax? Those weirdos said they wanted to reveal the true natures of Zacian and Zamazenta. I'm curious about what my former assistant said about royal lineage. Did she mean it literally? Ah, Bill, look at your town map! I'm detecting huge reactions at four stadiums now. They certainly get around. They certainly get around, don't they? If there's trouble at the stadiums, then Marnie could be a real bad way. 
Uh, Spike Muff seems to be okay. There's no power spot stadium there. Oh. <clears throat> right ho? Bill, there's no time to be lying about. If Pokemon are in trouble, why are we still here? Let's get right out there and lend a hand. I'm sorry to leave it all to you, but you'll have to take care of the Dynamax Pokemon. I'll search for those Sword and Shield weirdos in the meantime. Okay. So... So, that being the case, there is a lot of extra story to capture Zacian. So, we're going to go to a Pokemon Center, but we're going to check out where they might also be. In the meantime, that'll be it for today's episode. Make sure to hit the links below to follow me on social media. Make sure to give this video a like. Do subscribe, make sure to check out my other videos in the right hand column, and next time I guess we're going to have to save some more gems by doing gym raid battles. Later taters!